All right, hello everyone, Brandon Vandenberg here. This is a video for anybody who's having problems connecting their uh, their Oculus Quest, or at least trying to, maybe, maybe your Oculus Quest is connecting to your Windows device, but it's not it's not appearing uh, in, in, um, <clears throat> in uh, the, the uh, file explorer, but maybe it is appearing in the device manager. So if it's appearing in the device manager, if you wanna check that, um, you just press the Windows key and type in device manager, open that, uh, and then look for, um, USB root hub and see in, in the parentheses if it's a USB 3.0. Um, <clears throat> but basically they get the files off of it, so if you do a recording, or maybe you're trying to use, uh, things like SideQuest and BMBF, all that kind of good stuff, um, y you want it, you want it to show up there. <clears throat> so, this is really for anybody, for at least from my understanding, if you have BMBF and all that, my quest is in developer mode. Um, and that's pretty easy to figure out. That's really, I think, developer mode is how you really uh, get a lot of mods on there and whatnot, custom games off the side quest, all that kind of stuff. But, you want to record those games from your quest and have them on your computer. So, um... In the, in the actual Oculus, in settings, if you go down to the developer settings, uh, the USB connection, uh, I'll, I'll put what it's called on screen, uh, but it's like a USB connection thing. And if you have that uh, turned off, what that's gonna do is, uh, or if you have that turned on, what's that, what that's gonna do is it, it's gonna make your computer act like, I mean, maybe not all the time, but from what I've been experiencing, it's going to make your computer recognize the device. It'll show up in your device manager. However, it will not show up in your file explorer. So what you want to do is you actually want to turn that setting off if you have it on. And that is <clears throat> basically how uh, I was able to resolve this problem. Another thing you can, you can check is um, if your uh, port is a 3.0, because that's another problem. I don't know if... I. It, at least getting files off of it should work with 2.0, maybe even, I don't know if 1.0 still works, but it might. Um, but let me just go ahead and show you uh, what this looks like if it is on. All right, my bad. You actually want the setting off. I should be able to, I, I should have text over that. But if you have the USB connection dialog off, it, I unplug it, plug it back in. Let's see if this works. So we should be able to see uh, Oculus device here somewhere. There's Oculus device. If I unplug it, that should remove. Yes, it does appear to remove. So, uh, but as you see, it did not show up uh, over here in our file explorer. All right, now that I have the setting on, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put my headset on and it should give me uh, a prompt message saying, uh, do you want do you want to allow this device? And what you wanna do is you wanna click allow. All right, you don't wanna click do not show or anything like that, but if you do click allow, uh, what it should appear in your file explorer. So I'm not a complete tech tech expert actually when I was using this uh, To try to get Minecraft VR working. I knew this had 3.0 ports But the USB cable I, w I was using wasn't a 3.0 USB cable So you kind of have to make sure of those things it can be hard to tell uh, This is actually my Elgato capture card cord uh, So that uh, worked out nicely so thank you guys so much for watching. I'll try to edit this video down to make it a lot, lot, lot more easy to explain, uh, with like cat with closed t captions and all that, uh, on screen. You don't have to turn the setting on. I don't know how I'm gonna edit this, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this uh has fixed your problem. I'm not usually a tech reviewer, but I, I thought this might help some people. And um, yeah, thank you guys for nearly 500 subscribers. Uh, thank you is all I can say because that is. That so many uh, people have um, enjoy the content that I have made for them. So, so I, I want to thank you guys for that. I'll see you guys in the next video. Good.